What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Ark Army series. Everybody pretty much wanted to see the freaking Gigantopithecus army. Ape, gorilla, Bigfoot, whatever you want to call it. Either way, it's pretty beastly. So, there's been a lot of co controversy around these things since they uh, got put into the game. Uh, they were in Survival of the Fittest. A lot of people were using them to glitch and stuff because you could like fit inside it in the past and uh, things are being rebalanced and reworked but the point is to obviously um, you know you can sit on the shoulders of the thing and uh, it can throw you by hitting right click and so it can launch you up over uh, its shoulders and so you know if you got a base you want to get into or something like that you can just use them to toss you up into the air and I, I think I, I think I'm in god mode right now and so um, I'm not taking any damage, but left click will attack, you know. Uh, so basically what we've been doing in the Arc Army series is basically getting a bunch of these things and seeing how they work as a group to see how effective they are against things. Now obviously we know that they're pretty beastly in and of themselves, uh, but we're going to see what five of them can do. I've got a level 24, level 6, a level 24, level 42, and a level 114 which is the big guy. And so we're gonna just attack a couple things here and since we can pretty much ride on it, we don't need a, uh, and we have um, like a group of them. Oh, it took some damage there. We're gonna just see what they're capable of doing together. Oh my gosh, you see how fast they attack? <laughs> it's it, it is very it is very OP I got a little bit of a lag there or something let me see I got a couple that need to be leveled up I think uh, pretty good health on this one already yeah they are very very deadly let me let me let's do a uh, spyglass call here send them in and see how they'll do do I have them all with me yeah see how they do uh just kind of by themselves here without me oh gosh I don't even look at how OP this is they just attack everything <laughs> oh my gosh could you imagine setting them too aggressive it would be insane so we're gonna what we're gonna do a lot of people were asking Oh, look at that. Perfect. There's an Alpha Raptor. A lot of people were asking for me to test these out against Alpha things. Uh, to start doing the Army series where I test out against Alphas. And uh, I guess we're going to have our first test here on an Alpha Raptor. And then I'll do a Rex and everything too. Uh, we'll do a Carno and then we'll do a Rex as well. Gosh, they are just annihilating this thing. The good thing... Wow. The good thing is that when you have a when you have multiple of of a specific thing, uh, they have the ability to wow oh my gosh got a lot of levels out of that. They have the ability to take you know to have when they get hit they will rotate behind and uh, they'll rotate around and so then the next one will take damage instead of the one that was currently up in the front and so they some of these did take some damage it looks like but it wasn't anything too bad oh <laughs> one hit <laughs> it's like where are you going uh okay so i got a lot of cooked meats to, to to heal stuff well actually i don't think that's even working uh, it's gonna take some time i think so let's see here where's my beast one level 115 so, uh, five against an Alpha Raptor. Took a little bit of time, but it wasn't too bad. Let's see. I need to look up the command for the Alpha Carno. Um, let, let me look this up. Alpha Carno. All right. So, I'm going to uh, spawn one in. It should... They should start attacking. Let's see how it goes. They might get wrecked here. Five of them. I'm hoping not. Oh, two died. And the 115 is the only one left. And he's going to probably die as well. Yeah, he died. So, um, Karno is a bit too much for five of them. Uh, I wonder if I can spawn in a bunch of them and tame them. How much health does this thing have left? It looks like it's... 
I, I'm a god lord too, by the way, guys. It looks... Oh, wow, it was almost dead. So five of them almost killed an alpha carnal. And I should say, too, that all of these Gigantopithecus were not leveled at all. Uh, except for a few times just from what you just saw. And so it wasn't like I invested a lot of time into their stats or anything. But you can see how, you know, how OP... Uh, they can be. Alright, so welcome back. So I've, uh, got another one. And I have leveled it as max as I can. It has 6,400 health, but it's only currently at 1,600 and it's going up. But its melee is at 1,000, okay? So I want to see what this one ape can do when it's, like, pretty high maxed out in terms of melee. Because I have a feeling that it's going to be way more OP. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, so a max level... Wow, a max level one is a different story, it looks like. Yeah, holy crap. Just one shot and everything. It's a pretty beast thing to get, I think, and, uh... Worth having. I want to find something that is a little bit more intense. Like a, there we go. There's a Carno right there. It's not, it's not an alpha one. No, no, no. It's just got a cool color. There's a Spino too. You can test it on the Spino. It just, it looks like you have so such low health when you're like this. Wait, is it an alpha Carno? Actually, I think it is. Can you beat him? Can you beat him? Mounted one. Come on, you can do it, man. Yes! Apprentice Metal Hatchet. Uh, yeah, so I was able to do it. He's like got ridiculously low health, though. And I don't know if I have any way of healing him up quickly. Metal Apprentice Metal Hatchet. Holy crap. So, you can see that, you know, like, this is pretty beast in and of itself. So, if you were to spend some time and actually level things, and maybe if you're riding it and you're mounted on it, that might be a different story. I'm not entirely sure, but it seems to be pretty effective. I wish there was a way to quickly heal these things, because it's kind of annoying. Yeah, so uh, Gigantopithecus army is pretty beast and uh, capable of doing some awesome things by himself. This one at least. Just one shots things, it's so funny. Uh, yeah, so guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have, make sure to click that thumbs up button below. Feel free to subscribe if you're new to the channel and uh, leave me a comment and suggestion on what you think I should do next for the next ARC Army video series video. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.